All right, all right, I'm going through this process, so I might as well just show you guys how to do it right now. I'm going to be showing you guys how to get League of Legends characters uh, and their animations into Blender in 2024. There was an older video on this, except it's a little bit outdated, and I don't think it really explains... Um, it doesn't explain some issues that people might have so I want to try to cover them in this video as this is like so niche I'm surprised there's even a tool for this so shout out to this guy for making this tool and then making it free so to get started uh, the first two programs you're gonna to want to get are from the Microsoft Store you can just go down here and type in Microsoft Store are these two you're gonna to want to get one two three photos and 3d viewer they're absolutely tiny so just go ahead and get them they let you see a .dds file and they let you open a jltf file so you're going to need those the next i'll link these in the description you're going to want to come to this tool click code and then download zip and you can download them wherever i have mine in my riot games i have them both in the league of legends folder Obsidian is in here and Anim Compile is uh, this one or one of these. But go ahead and download this. Boom, you can put them wherever. Download zip, hit the drop down, download zip. One of them is going to ask you for your root League of Legends folder. That's Riot Games and League of Legends. And this is your root folder. So that's all you have to do. You just have to click this, this Riot.League of Legends folder. And then down here, you just click uh, Select Folder. So moving on, uh, you're going to click your first one, or it's going to be Obsidian. Let this load up. It's going to take a second, click File, Open. We're going to go to want to go to Data, Game actually, Data, Final, Champions. So when we're in here, this is going to be the champion uh, that you're looking for, and then you just select it but it's the wad.client. So it's champion name dot wad dot client is the one that you're gonna to wanna to be using. For my example, I'm gonna do ash. Uh, then you click open and you hit this drop down right here. Uh, before you do this, actually just to save yourself some time, click this preview on. It's gonna allow you to see the, uh, the character. So go ahead and drop that down that down characters and then it will extract some extra ones but that doesn't really matter we're dealing with ash right now and we're dealing with her skins so the skin that i was looking for was the prestige skin which is skin 65 and the way you see that is their calling card or loading screen so i was able to tell that number 65 was the prestige skin and when you're looking for a skin just scroll through and open these up and look for their cards some of them don't have them it means it was a skin that you know doesn't have a card like here's one so you know this is project ash but what you're going to want to do is is you're going to want to come to this skin and then go ahead and just click the box this is going to be all this ash assets file uh extract selected choose a folder. This is my second time doing this, so I'm gonna put this in the videos folder. And then you're gonna want her animations too. So unless you're gonna animate it yourself on Mixamo, you can do that. But in my case, I like to use the league animations. This skin only comes with this recall. So what you do is, is you grab the base, you grab the base animations, which are right there. Um, these have like all these ones in there, but there is an issue with this that I just had. They, there will be an issue with these latest animations that don't work or these old animations. You would click here, extract, and then extract selected. We'll just, we're just going to run through this. Actually, I'll just show you what I mean. Um, and I extracted it to videos, select folder, and let's go ahead and go back. So all my, uh, all my things have been exported to this folder. I'm going to go ahead and just cut these really quick and 
paste it there because we don't need all this extra crap. Uh, base and that. Cut and paste. You did not have to do that, but I, there's just so much nonsense in there that it doesn't even matter. These are the base animations, the base skin animations, and this is the skin that we just got. So, to save yourself some time, uh, let's go ahead and do this really quick. So, see, this is where 123 Photos comes in, so we can open, open as DDS. Uh, just click on, on that. So, we don't need the calling card. The ones that we're going to want is the skin and like anything that's extra so it looks like this skin only comes with its base skin uh these crystals these crystals and these crystals and then it repeats so it repeats with a lesser quality so the only ones we want is the highest quality one and we can see that by this is one uh 1024 by 1024 so we don't want to use this one because it's just it's not as clean it's older you can see the size isn't as big so let's go ahead we're going to want this one it looks like it's the one two three it's the third one in so it's going to be this one because this is the third one in this is also the third one in so we want this one and then it looks like this is two five six so this isn't the best quality uh crystal this is the better quality crystal and it looks like these two are the better quality and then it just repeats with worse quality. So the only ones that we're going to want right here are three, five, three, no, this is four. We want three, no, this is five, three, five, and six. It looks like so we count I uh, this is a little bit extra but I think it helps so we want three and then five and six so th these ones and that one so I'm just gonna delete everything that's not that uh, keep these skins the s the dot skl and the dot skn uh, so it's three we don't need four and oh actually we want three uh, see this is let's just do this I'm already losing track okay so we want to get rid of this middle one and get rid of all this okay perfect so it looks like now we have the best quality skin and the best quality pixels and then we also have her skin and her skeleton so to finally move on to the next thing, let's go into, oh, uh, where did we, wherever you put it, you want to go to lol, jltf, which in my case, it is my anim compiler. So it's lol to jltf. You're going to want to go ahead and open that up. And mine is glitched. So you go ahead and full screen that. Um, I think you might start environmental mesh, but you want to be in the skin mesh. Go ahead, click here. And it took me out of it, but assets, skin 65, that's the skin that we want. And this is the skeleton that we want. Now this part is a little bit confusing. So we want to choose the body. And this is where this program really comes in handy. So we know that this is definitely the body. And these are the crystals. So you're going to have to play around with this. Sometimes it's wrong. So I'll show you I'll show you what I mean. So let's say if I do body is this the body? The body the body again and we just keep going. Let's keep going. And then let's go ahead and JLTF and then I'll just drop it in here and name it just one cuz it's going to be a tester. Uh let's see. So what we just did was it looks like the body is correct and the cape. It's just the bow that's having the issues and the crystals at her feet. So I'm just going to delete that. And so it's the crystals. We'll grab this crystal. And then let's try all these crystals just on this bottom one. There's a little bit of a kind of troubleshooting you got to do. Let's see. Oh, we might have just gotten it first try. 
Okay, so this is it, obviously. Um, yeah, that's how that's going to be set up. So let's see if we do bow effects and we actually click the bow. Let's see what happens if we do that. Just name this two. I don't really know what changed, but it's still correct. So we do know that all these all these are correct and now we're going to do our animation so we chose our base animations animations and we're just going to do a basic uh running animation go ahead and jltf it boom let's name it again and there's going to be an issue and this is how you troubleshoot it as well so she's glitched running um this is terrible you don't want this so what you're going to want to do is let's delete that oh and by the way if you want to do this without the animations just don't put an animation there and it'll just put it in the form of a t pose so for you guys that want to hand animate it just just export it without an animation it's that simple so obsidian and jltf have an issue for me for some reason so i'm just going to go ahead and close it and then i'm going to go back into my Riot Games, League of Legends, Obsidian, and we're gonna go through this process again. I can close this out. Yeah, some, okay, file, open, let's go to game. So this, this, this issue that I'm showing you how to fix, so, Hopefully you're still watching and I haven't just boarded you completely. What I just did was I used the base skin for a newer model. This, that might work for you guys sometimes. Like sometimes the base animations are actually made for skins like that far ahead. So this is only for people that are having that leaning problem most of the time you will be using the base animations for your skin. So just remember that. I'm gonna show you how to fix this issue just in case you have it. I have no clue where I'm going. Data, game, data, final, champions. Uh, my champion was Ash. Now I'm just completely lost open so this is how you fix this issue that way you guys don't run into this that's not the hud it's the skin so the latest animations for skin 65 which is the one we're on are actually right here for skin 63 i think so you see how this has its anim oh wait no, no no it wasn't it was uh the skins that fix this one specifically so you just have to flip through here and you're just gonna have to find the skins that work i already know where it is i'm just showing you guys it's skin 52 right here so we were doing the walking one so let's go ahead and just grab these walking ones right here uh, I'm actually going to grab these idols as well because I'm going to need those for later. And I guess we'll just grab that dance um, and then go ahead and click uh, extract selected and you can just extract those to your video file. So these are the later animations that work for this later skin. So sometimes you'll be bugging like that and you'll just have to find different animations in here that will help you fix this issue. So moving on, we're gonna go to our JLTF full screen. We're gonna drop our skin 65 in there and we already know that this is what works with this. Add animations, assets, characters, ash, skin. So here it is, skin's 52. 
and uh, let's grab our uh, let's grab our jog JLTF boom we'll do blender video and now it works so this is how we want it to be this is correct that is not glitching so let's go ahead and drop it into blender it doesn't matter what blender you have I just have this older version because I have some crazy uh, plugins boom file let's go to import JLTF videos this one it upscaled it massively and go ahead and turn your things on and that's it I have no clue how to use blender but I knew how to do this and there you go and then to delete like this thing uh, you can type some crazy stuff like tab and then a and then like right mouse click or control a or control T I have no clue but whatever you can do there's you're gonna have to look it up there's a way to separate these um, yeah see I don't even know how to use this there's a way to separate them but yeah that's pretty much it crazy ass tool thank you thank you uh, brother for uh, making this sick ass tool yummy yeah,